Hi, so what I got here is one of the generic percussion massage guns. So the brand I got is Pan Panip. And the reason why I got this is because it is shaped and also designed very much like the $400 Hypervolt. So um, if you look at this, it does have the heat escape at the top, you know, so the motor is uh, very similar. And the design is that it does have the on-off switch in the bottom, but also the speed control on the LED. So let me go ahead and uh, you know show you around and also turn this on, and also talk about the eight attachments. And I'll uh, zoom in and give you a little bit more detail of you know how these things actually look, especially when they're vibrating. Uh, very close up and in detail, and it also does come with a carrying case that fits everything. Now, uh, this particular one has, uh, just like the Hypervolt, 3200 RPMs, but it has 20 speeds. So that is the main, that is the other main reason why I got this, is that it has 20 settings versus the three settings that the $400 Hypervolt has. And this particular one was only, uh, actually I got this for about 80 bucks. So uh, I'll have the links in the to Amazon where I got it in the description area of the video. Now I'm just going to turn this on and you'll notice there's an on button. So if I increase the speed, usually I have it on the lower speeds. Now this does say that it'll last six hours and that's on the lowest setting. I, I, I tested it at around four hours and uh, it does go to five hours, five and a half hours at uh, the lower settings. But I find that the lower settings themselves are actually very powerful already. So you could see that vibrating. So that's the lowest setting. And I find the lowest setting to be already very, very comfortable. Now you see that's the second setting. Now, now I'm just gonna go increase it to five. So you could see re the relative settings here of the vibration. And now I'm gonna increase it to 10. And you can also get a sense of the noise level. Now this is very quiet. And I'm gonna increase it to 15. So so I, I just love that it has those very subtle incremental increases. And that's 15 here. And now to 20. And this is of course the, the highest setting here. So, so at the highest setting, I imagine this would, would probably hurt a little bit. So, you know, I, I, I always keep it at the lowest setting. Now to turn it off, you could either, you know, turn off the bottom or simply push, you know, power in the middle to turn it off. Here is the battery life, which is at 99. So that's the highest recharged battery setting. Now you could remove the battery just by pushing this eject button here and the handle comes out. I also want to give you measurements of how big it is. So if you look at the handle, you know, that, that's, a, that's a good two inch diameter. Or if I just did it this way, you, you could probably see it a little bit better. The charging cable is at the bottom and it does give you an indicator, um, you know, just if, if you really want to know. So this thing's basically the size of a drill, you know, give, give you a sense of the length of this so that's the approximate size if you want to see the size of this here now let me go through some of the attachments so for this thing all you have to do is pull it off so it's a little bit harder for me because I, I am shooting a video but actually it's it's actually fairly straightforward well, when you just pull it out so, so this thing is actually sort of like a foam ball. Now I would, I would suggest that you never use this directly on the skin. What, what it does is it'll rub your skin off. Your skin will flake off on here and it'll get dirty. So just put it on sock or do it, you know, when, when, when you have clothes on or, or at least some cloth barrier. So, so you'll see that, um, you know, I do, I do have some sort of skin 
that that is still embedded in here because I I was doing it on bare skin uh, quite some time back. Um, now, now this is a soft sort of foam ball, and I do want to show you the mechanism here. So it just snaps on uh, fairly easily. You know, there's really not much strength. You don't have to use a lot of strength in order to put it in. Um, now let me focus on some of the other stuff. So the other soft attachment, it comes with eight attachments, is this rubber thing. So, so this here is pretty, pretty nice and soft and cushioned. And once again, you really do want to do this with a cloth or clothes on. And, and not have it directly massaging your skin. So that's the second one. Now all of these other ones are actually hard plastic. So this here is, is just hard plastic. And same with this thing is merely hard plastic. Now there is this, you know, three, five prong thing. And also this hammer thing. All of this is hard plastic. And similarly, this is also hard plastic. And this here is also hard plastic. So just to give you a little idea, I'm going to turn this to the one setting. And I will be putting this on my bicep. And I'm, I will be putting this in direct skin because this is just the hard plastic. And I'll be using this particular piece. And you could see how it's vibrating. And simply putting it on my bicep like this. And my forearms. So that's the low setting. Now even if I put it in setting 5, so I don't want to, the reason why I got this was because it had the low settings and it has 20 speeds and I'm just going to keep it at the low speeds because um, you know it works for me whereas the ones with 3 speeds or 5 speeds seems to be a little bit extreme so this has better granularity with the 20 speeds and if you want to look at the case I'll give you a look at the case here so just putting all of these aside here and opening up the case it comes with this AC adapter and the charging cable simply goes towards the bottom here. And the specs for this, it is, you know, 32 RPMs, just like the Hypervolt. It does have about five and a half hours of battery uh, at some of the lower settings. And it does have 20 speeds. And if you look at the case, um, the case more or less looks like this. So you could fit all of the accessories easily within the case. But um, all right, that's really it. That's really what I wanted to show and I hope this helps and uh, please subscribe and thank you for watching.